hello ladies and welcome back to my channel how is everybody doing today i hope everybody's doing well um today i wanted to come out and just show you guys a really quick diy that i came up with like at the last minute as you guys can see in front of you what is this is just trash right well no i don't see it as trash i try try to keep anything that looks good that i can still reuse um, certain bags some of these came with stickers and this is actually from um, as you guys can see it's from the dollar uh, spot at Target and they had a uh, this pretty much had just one sheet of stickers it was 27 count and I just loved the design on it I thought it was really nice especially right now for Halloween I said to myself I'm gonna keep it just in case now I always keep certain packages if they look good if they haven't been damaged even cardboard, things like that, I keep them because I can reuse them. Those scraps can be reused and why not, right? Exactly. So instead of just throwing it away, I'm going to show you exactly what I came up with with these two things. Now, the first thing I did with this one was pretty much cut the bottom off and all I came up with was a little tiny square. Um, I am sending this as a um, pen pal letter. Um, I wanted to send her some of these sticky notes, but I don't want to make it too heavy because I am sending a regular envelope. So I wanted something that is still says Halloween, but at the same time, it has a little bit of washi, uh, sticky notes, and maybe one or two paper clips. So this is what you will need. Now these sticky notes, I bought them, I believe it was the 99 cent store. Um, I am sending her just a few, not too many. And I am going to be using this little cat and these are from Daiso, the sticky notes from Daiso. And you get tons. If you guys have never been to Daiso and maybe there's one near you, you should go and check it out. If you're a planner, if you like to do pen pal letters, if you like to stay organized or do um, pocket letters, you need to go to Daiso. Daiso has awesome, awesome stuff and everything is $1.50. Well, I am going to go with the little black cat, black and white cat. This is not here just look like his little face. So I'm going to go with that and I'm going to be using the washi from Target, the one with the little kitty. Wow. So cute, right? I know, I love cats. I am a cat lady, seriously. And I'm also going to give her one of these little orange paper clips. As you guys can see, I ended up cutting the bottom and I made it into a square. And I just ended up putting the sample of washi right here on the top. Okay, so for example, this bag, I would actually throw it away. I mean, you could use this part right here. You could if you like, but the one that I actually um, had a cut previously looked a little better than this one. So all I did, like I said, since this has the sticky part still on the bottom, the resealable part, all I did was cut and I just measured it to make sure it fits. And it looks like this. And all I did was use this washi tape. You guys can find this at Target if you still can <laughs> and all I did was pretty much close the top off with that washi tape let me focus there we go and let me show you exactly what it looks like all right so this is how it looks like isn't that just adorable so all we're gonna do is we're gonna add all of the items in here and I'll be right back okay ladies so this is what it looks like once you are done using um your recycles, <laughs> your uh, arts and crafts recycles. So yeah, this is what it looks like. I hope you guys like this super quick little DIY. And again, the possibilities are endless. You guys can add more stuff to it. You guys can um, put even more goodies inside there. I mean, it is up to you, ladies. But I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little DIY. And again, ladies, thank you so, so much for watching. If you guys wanna see um, more pictures up close of this. I will be putting it on my Instagram. I want to thank all the ladies who have been checking out my Facebook page. Thank you so much. And I promise to be more active there and put more stuff there too. And remember, I don't always put the same things on my like page on Facebook. Uh, 
and on my Instagram, I try to switch it up so that way if you get to visit both, you're not looking at the same thing repetitively, okay? So thank you again so much, ladies, for watching. I want to tell you guys um, that I appreciate you. Thank you so much. And take care, ladies. We'll talk really, really soon. Bye-bye.